Crayola. Hey, what you excited about, buddy? Package time. My first eBay pet. Oh, oh my God. Are you to bite? Hold. Hold. Ah! Oh. Hey, buddy. Hey, Scooby. Hey, what's going on, guys? We are back at it. And today, a lot of you guys have been asking me to do it. And Lily also has been asking me to do it. And today we're going on eBay and ordering a brand new pet. So check it out. All right, guys. So let's head it to eBay. We're heading to eBay. I'm so excited to finally be doing this. Now, we got to search for a live aquarium. Oh, fish? Yeah, let's go with fish. Let's see what we have for live aquarium fish on eBay. All right. We have a baby bicher, red tails, some mosquito fish. Black worms, ooh, flower horns, guys, flower horns, big ones. Oh, they're actually little ones, but they can turn big, like Mega Mine. And we have dwarf pea puffers, a whole bunch of stuff. Red belly pacus, electric blue carpenitis. Ooh. It's really interesting, isn't it? It's pretty. You know what? <laughs> Let me see if they have this for sale. Hold on one second. Let's see. Well, Pima. Oh, my God. Whoa, they do. Four inch Arapaima gigas. Comes from Massachusetts. I'm assuming you have to comply with all the laws and stuff. Yeah, you do. So, unfortunately, we can't keep them here. Even though Predatory Fins does have them, he has to ship them to legal states. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. But someone sent me something a long time ago that I was curious to see if they had it. And as you can see, I did check a long time ago. And I want to see if we can pick one up. Oh, my God. Oh, my. Do you see this, guys? I didn't even know that existed. Look at this. Look at these ghost crawfish. Red claws, brown, black. Interesting. Look at that. The whites. It's ridiculous. It's out of this world. Oh, they have a pair? A pair for <laughs> 40 doll hairs. Oh my god. Look at that. Imagine getting a male and female and actually getting them to breed. And you have multiple of these guys. We might have to do this. But I don't really have the room right now. For a male and a female, because we have Crayola with her babies, so we're gonna not look at those. This, oh my god, they have it the Procambrius Clarky, the ghost crawfish, wow, or crayfish. Look at the colors on this guy, jeez, jeez Louise. If you look right here, guys, as you can see, it's blue, pink, with some white, a little bit of red. It's out of this world. That's gorgeous. It's, that's insane. We're going to have to possibly purchase this one. We're good. Yeah, you know what? Might as well go to Aquatic Carts, guys. Good reviews, 98.9%. Add to cart. Oh, choose variant. So we're going to get a ghost crawfish, juvenile or crayfish. I like to say crawfish or, you know, mini lobsters. So let's add <laughs> it to cart. We're good to go. So we're going to check out. And it should be here in about 24 hours. They do the same day or next day air. Oh, next day air. So... We'll be back tomorrow with our new ghost crayfish. Hey, what you excited about, buddy? Package time. It's package time. I know it's dark. I know it's dark. Hold on. Relax. Go, 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 go. Lily, do we have a package? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It finally freaking came in. Here's everything. Everything, buddy. Here's everything. All right, hold on. It's getting dark, guys. Come on. Come on, Max. You're, you're making us dizzy. Pipe down. Close the door, Come dude. On, that's what I'm talking about. Let's go ahead and make sure that my address is covered this time because in the lobster video, it was not. Well, to go ahead and protect the seller's identities, we went ahead and covered my address and his and the tracking number because there's some creeps out there trying to get at me. We don't want, we want none of that. So without further ado, can you go ahead and open this box? Yes. Lily, you got this. Open it up. Sure. I'm so excited. This is my first eBay pet. Oh, oh my gosh. Did, I stab to Did that? you stab to me? Oh my deep? gosh. You got I think it? we're okay. All right. Just open up that thing. We don't get time to wait. <gasps> oh my God, it's here. It's here, but it's not what I ordered. Where's the styrofoam? That's what I'm saying. What? This is not what I ordered. I did not order this. Please. Even though it's really cool, this is not what I ordered. I ordered like a pink and white ghost crawfish, and I got a red, white, and blue um, crawfish. Like, don't get me wrong, guys. Like, this is really cool. This is really awesome, but, uh, it's kind of not what I ordered. It's like getting a number two at McDonald's when you ask for a Big Mac. 
With no pickles? With no pickles, and they added extra pickles. Oh, man. That is not what I asked for. But this is still cool nonetheless. This is what I kind of wanted to made with red, white, and blue when I had the other crawfish that uh, Lily accidentally lost. He's, hey. It's it was okay. An it's fine. We forgive you. The Slayers forgive you. Don't forgive her. She's weak. Anyways, <laughs> but guys, as you can see, like this is not what I ordered. This is what I ordered right now. And as you can see, this is kind of not what I ordered. Mm, I'm sorry, bro. Like, I'm going to give him a good review and everything, guys. And you guys should still order from him because this is still a pretty cool crawfish. But, wow. It's red, white, and blue. So it's a combination of just about everything. So he's still a gross craw. Look at that. He has he's white. Cute. He has white. There's blue on top and red. So it's still pretty sick. So I have a tank set up. Good to go. Let's go ahead and head upstairs as well and look at Crayola. Well guys, we made it to the infamous crawfish room and this is the tank I have ready for our new inhabitant, which is still pretty interesting. Now, if we look above guys, there's some blue, a little bit of brownish red, and there's white spots and his antennas are actually white. Let me, let me go ahead and pick them up for you guys to go ahead and see. And it's amazing. I can't wait to really see him inside of the tank under better lighting so we can really appreciate them. So the thing is, this tank has been good to go, cycled the whole nine yards and is worm free. Yes, worm free. We don't want worms. Oosh. Guys, if you haven't seen that video where all my cr freaking crawfish had worms and I gave them a bath, oh, gave me the heebie-jeebies. But if you look here too, guys, this is actually amazing. So we obviously gonna need a name. He's red, white, and blue. I thought about Patriot. Because it's kind of cool, you know? Patriot's pretty interesting, but like let me know in the comments below what you think. Go ahead and name this ghost crawfish. So, without further ado, Lily, with your help, you yes. mind uh, opening up this tank so we can go ahead and activate him? Yes. Man, what an interesting, He's interesting cool. crawfish. Because I wanted a male for future babies with Crayola, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, he's unique, though. He's very unique. I've uh, never let's seen see him specials. down under. Oh! Wow. Look at the white specks oh my God. on his claws and the white antenna. Dude, he's pristine. He has every single part of him perfect for a crawfish. Big antennas, big claws, wow. the white. Wow, that's amazing. So we're going to go ahead and allow him to acclimate right here. I don't have to quarantine him because he's alone, but wow, look at the blue popping now. Yeah, this is a really, really, really cool crawfish. What do you think? He's cool. I like the speckles on his claws. I really I've never enjoy seen it. That. Yeah, it's very unique. It's, I think, a combination for sure between red, white, and blue. So, with that being said, guys, let's go ahead and check on Crayola. Well, guys, we have made it back to my epic fish room with my magical man, Ninja, the water cow goby. Come up, buddy. Oh, yeah, 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 boy. Look at that face. Only a face the Slayers can love. Are you to bite? Hold. Hold. Ah! Oh! He didn't hold. He's hungry. He's hungry. We might have to do a feeding video with you very soon. Now I have my gopers here hiding in the gopher lair. Look at my blobs. That's one. There's Shrek and Fiona hiding right there. They just love the lair. And then when you drop a goldfish right up here, you go boop. They come out to play. So let's go ahead and check on Crayola. Now I'm going to do something I haven't done yet. We're going to go ahead and check on her babies and see what's going on. Oh, sorry. I haven't done it before, but we're going to go ahead and check to see how she's doing. Could you roll up my sleeve? I don't want to get my hoodie wet. I have a problem. Hold. Nice. Nice. Get you a girl that pulls all your sleeves up, you know? You know, you have the guys that hold your hair when you vomit. Oh, stop. Get your girl that pulls up your sleeves when you, when you go inside a fish tank. So we're going to go ahead and check on Crayola and see how she's doing. Hello. Crayola. Hi, looking blue as can be. So I don't want to harass her too much, but I would do want to check up on her eggs. How are those eggs doing? Mm -hmm. Looking good, developing. Now I do see one infertile egg. Unfortunately, it's not fertile, but I see plenty of developing babies, guys. Oh wait, Ooh. she's getting spooked. We're looking at her butt, you know? Ah. I'm gonna go ahead and let her do her thing. Let her be alone. And these eggs will hatch naturally in this great environment. Whoa. Ninja is insane. Look at this guy right here. Guys, come above real quick so you can see. He's so hungry. He's so hungry. I'm going to go ahead and pet him. Good boy. Oh, you bit me last time. Will you do it again? Good boy. Good boy. You see? Oh, man, I love this guy. All right. Let's go ahead and put our crawfish inside of its tank. 
Well guys, the time has finally come where we go ahead and get our awesome new crawfish that we got from eBay mm -hmm. inside of this tank. Are you excited? Are you excited? I am. Are you excited? I'm Are you excited, little him. man? Are you excited? Yeah, he's like, bro, get me out of here so I can pinch you. <laughs> it's bro, been a long he's ride. He's having a hard time. Yeah, it's been a long ride. Poor guy. So let's go ahead and get this guy out real quick. The slayers are waiting. Open it! Sorry. Pour out the water. You want to go and handle the crayfish? Or you want me to handle it? I, I can try. You can try? I can try. All right. All right, buddy. Come out, my friend. I got your back, Jack. All right, Jack. Look at the colors of this guy. He's Look at cute. that red, blue, and more red. Let me put the flash so you can see the colors. Wow, guys. So as you can see, Look at the colors of our man right here. Wow. How unique. His antennas are white. His body is blue. His tail is red. His claws are both red and blue in combination right here. Wow. Look at that. You see that, guys? Look at the colors on that and the white specks on his claws. If we look on his underside, you can see the, where the red came from. So he's a most likely a combination between a white crawfish a fireball crawfish and a blue lobster. Wow. So he's a male also. I'm gonna hold this right here. He's a male also because he has those hardened swimmerettes. So he'll be mating with, ow, ow, he almost oh got me. God. He's gonna be mating with Crayola after her babies. I don't wanna stress this guy out because he's actually gonna get me eventually. So if Lily can follow me all the way over here, we're gonna add this guy into the tank. Wow, look at the colors oh on him. Gosh. Look at those colors, guys. He looks so good. No, don't hide. Look at the blue, the reds. Wow. This is possibly the coolest crawfish we have ever owned together. Look at that. He is popping. So we're most likely going to have to set up an enclosure for him. But look at that. Wow. As much as I enjoyed having my crawfish in the 15 gallon tank, I do want them to be in like those little 2.5s because then actually I can hand feed them. Look at that. That's insane. You know what's pretty crazy? You think, um,. You think he'll eat? Let, let's go ahead and give it a shot. Maybe he'll eat. So I have my <laughs> magic board, the lights right here, which it's usually the prime crawfish bait we use. Zach and I use it. It's really stinky. So I'm gonna grab, I gotta go find my tongs. Hold on one second. That second was really quick. I got my tongs. And I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of these pellets right here. And it should be really easy to feed crawfish. You just gotta, they're like catfish. You gotta hit the whiskers. So there's his whiskers, you see him? Mm -hmm. His antenna. Just keep an eye there and see if he'll eat, right? Okay. Let's see, look at that disbursement. Look at him going crazy. He oh smells gosh. stuff. Oh. Turn around every now and then again. Oh, here you go. I think he likes it. He sees it. <gasps> maybe oh he gosh. senses it. Oh yeah, he senses it. Oh. But he's not gonna maybe eat it. Not. Is he, where'd he go? Oh, he's hiding. He's hiding? He's oh. getting used to his Here, home. get in front right here. Let's see if he eats. Oh, oh my God, he's gonna oh eat. Oh my God. I've never fed a crawfish with tongs before. <laughs> guys, look, he's eating. He's eating 100%, guys. Wow, oh. I guess they starved him. Look, back into my cave he goes. So guys, with that being said, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Guys, we're flying. We're freaking flying, man. We're over 100,000 because of you guys. So let's make it to 200,000. Let's keep it going so we can get merch, so we can get new fish, so we can get new stuff for the channel, man. I'm so excited. So with that being said, I'll see you in the next one.